Welcome back to a FS17 mod review here on the Square Farms map. Today we'll be taking a look at a variety of cars. A airport fire truck, a few cat trucks, a excavator, and a semi-trailer. Up first we'll be taking a look at the Ferrari 458 Italia sports car. Here it comes in white. And up front you guys can see the license plate is here off to the side to make it a little bit more sporty. Now as we do come around to the side, take a look at those brakes, the very big brakes. You guys can see those rotors do look pretty cool there as well and very nice looking wheels and then as you do come around to the back very nice looking and take a look at that Ferrari engine that is so cool very realistic car those are some great graphics down there that just looks awesome why don't we hop here on the inside this has a top speed of 152 miles per hour all of the lights do work here on this which is awesome and it has reverse lights everything like that and this thing really does look pretty cool now on the first person view you guys can see it does have a very nice working steering wheel and very deep detailed interior as well this looks awesome you guys can see the start button there is on the steering wheel but wow this is awesome you guys can see 458 Italia over there and this thing looks pretty cool all of the modelings will be down below here in the description of today's mod review we'll head out here into the street and we'll give it some acceleration take off that it's actually a little bit slower acceleration than what I would be expecting it but wow this thing really does have some nice engine sounds as well and as you guys can see, it does have lights up top uh, on the steering wheel that do function, which is always pretty cool. The handling of this is actually very nice as well. You guys can see going up there on the sidewalk, but wow, this thing really does handle on turns, which is perfect. And uh, there looks to have been quite a lot of mods recently that have come out, which is nice. And I can't wait to do more mod reviews here for FS17. And then it will be switching over to FS19 to feature all those epic mods. Up next, we'll be taking a look at a very cool Range Rover here convertible. Take a look at this, guys. Very nice. It is color changeable. Very big wheels here on it. That looks awesome. And it is actually pretty small and compact. Now, there is one with a top if you would like in the store. You guys can see this thing looks pretty cool. Dual exhaust. And that looks awesome. Once we hop here on the inside top speed of 76 miles per hour and this thing looks pretty cool all of the lights do work here on this which is pretty cool and on the first person view it does have a working steering wheel and you guys can see it does also display that the turn signals are working just take a look at the very high quality interior of this that looks awesome and you guys can see it also does have working gauges over there that's awesome I really do like having uh, cars here in uh, farming cylinder 17 it's pretty cool uh, just to have them uh, we could use them for repos even drive them around to different shops and it just adds to the variety and farming cylinder is awesome for mods you pretty much uh, build whatever you would like and that's just awesome so next up we will be taking a look at a very expensive uh, car this is Rolls Royce Dawn take a look at this guys awesome color really do like this uh, Rolls Royce wheels and this thing looks pretty cool it was made by Winston 9587 and we'll hop here on the inside there's a few things that we can do up first we gotta take a look at underneath the hood with a keypad seven take a look at that guys very very nice very detailed which is pretty cool keypad eight and nine will open up the doors and that looks awesome there just take a look at that very high quality and for Rolls Royce they actually have buttons that close the doors everything like that and then to open up the trunk is J so we'll open up the trunk really fast you guys can see there's a spare tire in there which is awesome so it does have all working lights you guys can see everything does work here and on the first person view working mirrors working steering wheel and working gauge is very very high quality almost looks like you're in one of these it's just so cool and uh, i really do like rolls royces especially to have one in farming saloon it's going to be pretty cool especially to take in camping and whoa you guys can see almost pulling really back there if you guys would like to see more mod reviews let me know down below here in the comments with any mods that have recently come out and i will definitely do a review here on them up next we will be taking a look at a mod by wood metal farming this is an airport fire rescue truck take a look at this engine one this thing looks awesome here i really really do like a lot the looks of this is pretty cool once we hop here on the inside this has a top speed of 51 miles per hour all of the lights do work here on this which is nice it does a beacon lights and then v will turn on the red led lights no interior but that is okay this thing is pretty cool and it does have a few sounds as well 
Overall one very, very cool truck. Nice acceleration, but this is mainly just for airports. The turning radius isn't the best, but it is also a very big truck at the same time. Up next, we'll be taking a look here at a cat a hook truck here. One pretty cool truck. This is compatible here with the IT runner pack. This thing looks awesome. Really do like the cat wheels, the logo there in the center. You guys can see all of those detail there. Very nice big hook as well. Uh, uh, tri axles here in the back with Michelin and looks like this one actually turns and that's going to be pretty helpful for uh, turning as well so once we hop here on the inside top speed of 75 miles for all of the lights to work here when you do press X the arm does work take a look that that back wheel does turn which is perfect and when you do have this working you can't actually drive it fast so it does add to the realism there but that is okay it does have beacon lights we'll check out all of the other lights and on the first person view working mirrors working steering wheel and working gauges and very high quality truck in general so once that lowers uh, the speed does increase yep uh, you guys can see the speed increases there so very nice handling as well I mean this thing just looks awesome up next we'll be taking a look at a very similar cat but this time this has a flatbed here on the back really do like it a lot now I might look into adding an area to attach a forklift to the back that would be a pretty cool delivery forklift and then we could turn this into a delivering truck it does have a lock load which is a big bonus it does have that turning axle there in the back and all of these lights do work here on and take a look at that, that looks awesome and on the first person view it does have the very similar specs, we'll take this one here for a quick spin to see how this does and I really do like these cat semi trucks, these look pretty cool and here in Farming Cylinder they are pretty popular, there are many different versions and I just like having all of those, now this actually has like a little uh, see through uh, wall up front and that's most likely to protect the cab from any load but that is okay Up next, we'll be taking a look here at an excavator. And when you do purchase it in this store, there's many different uh, Bible ones, which is pretty cool. This is the Lean Berg 936, and this uh, bucket here does have the teeth. But there's a variety of buckets and a few different tracks, and uh, you could get a uh, cage to protect this uh, excavator if you would so like it. But this thing is awesome. Really do like it a lot. It has working uh, beacon light, everything like that. And actually, very fast loader. Uh, arms. I mean, that's just so fast. Could be pretty helpful. You definitely will have to get used to it, but I really do like it a lot, though. And that hook there does work. So you guys can see there's a hook. So that does work, which is pretty cool. The last mod we'll be taking a look at today is the Load King trailer. Now, this is very similar to the previous one that was released, but this time, there's a few things different. First off, the paint scheme is different, and this one only goes up when uh, you unfold it, and this goes up a lot higher. So we'll just attach to it, kind of show you it, and this one was actually found on the official website so that's actually pretty cool uh, being over there so we'll just attach to it show you guys it really quick and then it will call it a day we'll back up here and attach now as you guys did see that does come out there take a look at those animations that is awesome I really do like that and then when you press X that will raise up and then that will tip uh, until but you guys can see it does lift up a lot higher than it uh, the other one here in Farming Cylinder it does have a lock load and a few other things like that. I hope you guys enjoyed today's mod review here on the Square Farms map. Check out all of the mod links down below here in the description. Have a great day and subscribe for more.